Hey everybody, Jim and Joshua here to talk about the trailer for the big uh, DC animated movie coming up, Justice League, Throne of Atlantis. Yes, this one's all about Aquaman and the Justice League, but you know, Aquaman was not in the Justice League War movie that came before this one, and uh, now we see why. They wanted to yeah. save it to for, give his big introduction for his own movie. Oh, there's our first shot of the League. First, I want to go back here. You know, the inciting incident, I believe, is that you know, this nuclear sub um, was uh, commandeered, we'll say, by some unscrupulous folk. Yeah, there's some blood splatter. Yeah, and uh, and they're using that to incite a war between the surface world and uh, the Atlantis. Although I think this cutaway here to the League, it's going to be later in the movie since this is essentially Aquaman's origin story and they're clearly all, all together here. But you have um, Green Lantern, and he's voiced by Nathan Fillion. Nathan Fillion, yes. And then Rosario Dawson is Wonder Woman. Yes, this is true. And you know, Aquaman is is by uh, Matt Lanter, uh, who we know is Anakin Skywalker from the Clone Wars cartoon. Or next to him is is Mira, his wife in the comic books. But you know, I don't. I think they'll have just met maybe uh, yeah. in this movie. We also have Cyborg and Superman he's here. Cycl uh, yeah, Cyborg. Cy yeah, I, I Cyclops. Keep, why am I saying Cyclops? Oh, ah, there's, there's first Atlantis. Look at Atlantis. That's pretty cool. Going through, and here we Ooh. have Orm, uh, Aquaman's brother on the left, and then Black Manta, Aquaman's arch nemesis on the right. There, I loved Black Manta in the old Super Friends cartoon. Black Manta, that <laughs> funny voice. Now this is interesting. It almost looks like a, it, I believe it's a funeral procession. Of yeah, some kind. yeah. It looks like looks looks like the Queen of Atlantis, the Queen Atlanta, at, at Atlanta, uh, who we'll get a little better look in a second here. But those look like. Bodies wrapped in seaweed, and right here, if we uh, we go a little bit more, there's Orm and Black Manta again. It looks like they're trying to show her these bodies of these people who were killed. I uh, don't know how yet, uh, but to show her that hey, like this, our people are dying. We need to we need to fight the surface dwellers. Can you stop and just scroll back a little bit? I just want to point out an odd choice. Um, why do you need steps if you can basically swim up? Listen, there? Jim, you're getting a little <laughs> too picky for me there. <laughs> right on you, right on you. That was, that was good, good point. Yeah, so here's, you know, uh, Queen Atlanta, Aquaman's mother, pointing out that, you know, hey, we need someone to bridge the gap. And there's Owen Wilson. Owen, w <laughs> Owen right. Wilson, yeah, he needs to bridge the gap between the two worlds. Um, and it looks like, again, this will be sort of an origin story for him. It looks like he's sort of, you know, roughing it on well, the Well, somebody's the coast. trying to kill Marty McFly here. <laughs> nice and vest. Um, uh, this is actually a pretty graphic seeing a knife going to his chest. But, uh, you know, it, it, you, you explained to me before that basically because of the... The pressures needed to survive underwater. Aquaman basically has uh, impenetrable skin, and then he kills this guy. No, no, he'll he'll survive. He's throwing him into the water. Yeah, I don't know. He's gonna hit that yeah. water pretty hard. Aquaman is often a joke, right? Right. Like, he's the butt of a lot of jokes. So they're trying to show that he's someone to be taken seriously. Then here's someone who wants to be taken seriously: or Orm and his Ocean Master guys. Oh my goodness! Uh, with an entire army, and then this super powerful uh, glow stick. That uh, he's going to use. <laughs> I to, think that's called a trident. A trident, yes, yes, to wreak some havoc. Uh, there's Mera again. And now this is interesting because they're going to they're going to try and take out Metropolis, but. Who's looking at the screen? Superman's not there. Yeah, where Three is Three guys he? who don't live in Metropolis all being like, where's <laughs> Superman at? I don't, I don't know. know. Well, here's I Batman we he's calling for, for Aquaman. And uh, there's being taken to Atlantis, looks like, for the first time. And looks like she's showing him his legacy. You know, his father was uh, a man who ran a lighthouse on the surface. His mother was the queen of Atlantis. So he is sort of like the prince of Atlantis. And he's being shown this... This Atlantean armor, it looks like, but if we if we go forward a little bit, he puts it all on, but then he sort of drops some of it. He's like, I just need this orange sweater. <laughs> and we get the classic the lock of Aquaman hair was getting in outfit. my eye when I wore my, my helmet. <laughs> That's pretty cool, a little origin yeah. for that. Kind of like, uh, I think you pointed out that it, it was... It's kind of like the Man of Steel movie and yes. how they explain... You know, essentially where the outfits come from, that they are armor with an un, uh, with a bodysuit underneath it, which totally makes sense. It's yeah. essentially chain mail for a knight. Yeah, he's like, I don't need that exoskeleton I mean, it looks cool. armor. It, it does look pretty cool. That is pretty cool. Uh, of course, you know, this is an Aquaman movie, but it looks like the full Justice League is there as you well. You know, do you think does Batman kind of feel left out because he has to actually fly a plane there and everyone else just lands on their You know, feet? it is a pretty cool plane, though. There, yeah. This looks like Aquaman and Mira down at the bottom in front of the Atlantean people. It looks like he's got the trident. It's, maybe this is at the end of the movie. Oops, spoiler. I don't know. <laughs> maybe he unites them all and they cheer. No, actually, um, I thought this was interesting. I had never seen Black Manta without his, his mask on. Yeah, there he is. Yeah. He is... Uh, some bad, bad. He's a piece of work in the comic books. He's really uh, awesome, like evil bad guy. Uh, 
And it looks like he's teaming up with Orm for this. Now, this is interesting. These guys were a creation of the new 52, which this movie clearly is borrowing a lot from, as uh -huh. all the new movies are. But um, I think tell them what these this, guys are. This, tr this race is known as The Trench. And in the Aquaman comics, it started with a story called The Trench, where he fought these guys who came up from the uh, co from the from the depths of the ocean and were pretty much eating people. And he like stopped them. And then later on in the comics, he had the, the Throne of Atlantis crossover. So it looks like they've taken these two Aquaman stories and merged them together, maybe? Yeah. And he's very uppercut there. Lots of Justice League action. Of course, was Captain Marvel in there as well. Oof. This looks is this like Metropolis. Yeah, I'm yeah. thinking this is, is Metropolis. Oh! Okay, I'm loving the Sharknado moment. <laughs> and also, not only is it Sharknado, Black Manta's in his mouth. Yeah, so everyone always makes fun of Aquaman, but when he does something like this, summon a shark to eat his enemy, that's pretty cool. I almost wish they didn't put this in the trailer because I'm sure yeah. this is going to be like a great, <laughs> awesome moment in the in the movie. But yeah, this is this very uh, very cool Aquaman now, moment. Can you go back for a second? Is that that ship that oh, wow. was just there? Uh, whose ship is that? Is that, a, is that Black Manta's ship? Or is Maybe. that an Atlantean ship? I don't, I don't know. know. We'll find it's out. Not it is, it is blowing stuff up, though. I'm assuming it's yeah. a bad guy ship. There's Orm again parting the, the sea to unleash his army. And uh, here's Superman fighting like a Leviathan. Ooh. Yeah. Don't mess with Superman. Oh. Do not mess with Superman. That, that he's going to cool. need an Advil. Now, uh, this movie comes out in early 2015. Mm -hmm. And then there's a little tag here. Where Wonder. they name him. You, I named the Aquaman. <laughs> <laughs> awesome, guys. Well, thanks for listening and watching.